all right. That's fine. My goal is to come up with a blend that will really help me rest and sleep and unwind at night. So looking for different herbs that I can use to experiment and then really just figure out what works. Okay, all right, that's fine. Okay, think we got you sexy for that metro house. How are you? This diamond popped out, almost swallowed 60,000. Section need more things in here, I like it crowded. Like, whoa, whoa. Yeah, I like it crowded. Oh, you like the boy? Well, tell me what you like about him. You a turtle. This is the ultimate taste test. Mmm. Mmm. Tea or like drinking tea or even just having tea next to you is literally like it's like a hug it's like having a friend or just like having company this might sound really crazy but this is actually how i feel about tea i just love it before i go to bed i generally just want to talk to you this is the perfect time to reflect and to look back on the past week the past month the past year and really just take this time that you have to yourself because we get so carried away in what's happening right now what happened yesterday what's happening tomorrow what we're looking forward to what's making us nervous da, 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 da. like we're literally always thinking and always on the move in here that we actually forget like hmm how can I actually learn from the things that I've experienced? How did it make me feel? Is this something I want to experience again? Like instead of spending time worrying, and I know this is obviously really easy to say, but I think it's a practice. I think like the way we are here right now, just like right before bed, you know, have a nice cup of tea, maybe a book, and really just sit down and breathe and just think back on maybe the day even you can start small and ask yourself what went well what could have gone better what you enjoyed what made you smile what you would want to carry on into your day tomorrow and making reflection a practice like this in the smallest ways it helps us really grow an appreciation for ourselves and for all the things that we've been through my voice sounds weird it's the tea Anyways, I think the older I get, the more I realize that life can be so unpredictable and life can be really tough if you if you let it. It can be really tough. I feel like there's so many little things that people don't talk about, especially in your 20s. There's so many little things that we all go through, but people choose to only show you what's going well, which is all well and fine. But I feel like those of us that are actually living and experiencing Experiencing this um, I want you to know first of all that it's not in any way a smooth ride like this is literally the time for you to make as many mistakes as possible and that's why I'm also trying to encourage you just doing less thinking and worrying and, and anxiety because this is a time where if we let our thoughts stop us from taking an action or if we let our thoughts stop us from you know seeing our progress and congratulating ourselves then we're sort of losing out on this time where we are supposed to be actively making mistakes and learning and unlearning and relearning and evolving and just becoming the version of us that we're supposed to operate in this world as you know i feel like it's so easy to look at people on the outside you see a nice picture you see you know a new job you see a, a marriage or something like that and you're just like oh wow you know things must be great we all experience this in whatever scale but like any other thing in life is really important to also always just pay attention to yourself pay attention to how these things make you feel and pay attention to what's actually going on in your own life a lot of times when we pour out our energy to other people and to other situations it takes away from our own experience in the sense that if we spend more energy judging or criticizing or observing other people then it's like what are you giving to yourself how are you pouring attention and love and and any sort of energy to the things that you want and to the life that you want to create and i think ultimately that's the most important thing because like i said your 20s is the time to mess up this is the time to just live you know really just live and i'm saying this to myself too 
too because there's so many things that I want to do and I've stopped myself so many times but I'm not gonna beat myself up on that as well because I understand that I've only been on this planet for 20 something years I've literally I just came I'm new <laughs> well I'm not new new but you know I'm I'm in that like what I call this maybe like year seven year eight year nine phase of life i literally barely know what i'm doing and it would be really unfair for me and it would be really unfair for you to expect to just know what to do and to also measure yourself based on what you see from other people not even the reality of other people's even if there is a reality of other people's experience like it's really unfair for us to compare ourselves in that way so yeah i just think take it a little bit easier on yourself before you go to bed at night get off your phone make yourself a delicious warm cup of tea get a book maybe some light music you can get a journal out you can just sit lay there breathe and think and just look back on your day and thank yourself for showing up that day thank yourself for waking up that morning thank yourself for doing everything that you did that day even if you didn't do anything that you wanted to do that day thank yourself for doing the things that you did if it's you got up okay thank yourself for that if it's that you took a shower i know sometimes it can be really hard to even just get up and take a shower thank yourself for that because that is something that you succeeded in doing no matter how small and even if it's something huge you deserve that gift to yourself and i think this practice also helps us to see the more we do this little by little each day when it comes to the bigger things and the bigger achievements then it's easier to celebrate yourself rather than looking oh what's my next goal what's the next thing i want to achieve it's easier to just sit down and be like wow like you have done amazing you have come such a long way and i want that for all of us like i want that for myself i want that for you and i know that we're in this together we can do it just don't forget yourself forget about any other person forget about what they're doing what they've done and just put that focus on you everything's going to be fine everything is working out you might not really see it right now i can't see it right now but this is a moment where i feel good and i really want to pass that energy along to you last last we're all going to be fine so go make tea go relax go breathe go write go unwind go and thank yourself and congratulate yourself and wake up and be ready to kill it again tomorrow okay <laughs> okay good night if you have enjoyed this video leave me a comment i love hearing from you guys drop a like so i can know if you want me to continue making videos like this and subscribe to the channel okay i love being here with you and i would love to continue to do this and i would also love to share this tea with you by the way like this is so freaking good so yeah good night i love you